So is this you and are you tired of going through vents super slow and wasting time on going through it? Well, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to become the reincarnation of Foon. Hello everyone, my name is Matt and welcome to a new video on my channel. In today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to do a vent hop. I just felt your bitch, just a bowl of socks. I just said a lick. Now, what exactly is a vent up? As you can see, there's a vent on the CT side of Mirage and you probably all know it whenever you're going through mid. It's a pain in the ass to go through here and waste time on crouching underneath there. Because it basically takes a lot of time to just, I don't know, waste your time crouching underneath there. It's slow as fuck. So basically what a vent up is, is I'll show you what it is. As you can see, I just did a vent hop. As you can see, I didn't have to waste time crouching underneath this thing. So, um, yeah, I just flew underneath there. And that way you can save, like, I don't know, half a second and be in mid earlier. Maybe push up faster. I don't know. I do know that it's a very nice thing to know how to do. So I'm going to show you guys how to do it. Also, a very nice thing is whenever you have an enemy, for example, um, sitting right there. Let's say there's an enemy right there at the moment. And you're doing a uh, crouch hop uh, through the vent real quick over here. And you kill them like this. It would be way faster to kill him like that and it would be really unexpected because who's gonna expect someone to fly through the vent and kill you over there instead of crouching very slowly underneath here. Well basically the guy can just tap you over here. And if you're flying through here, you're, I don't know, it's just very unexpected for the guy who is waiting for you. So now I'm gonna show you how to do the vent hop and it's actually not that hard but I do know it looks complicated and it's actually not that complicated so I'm gonna teach you how to do it. Now a very common mistake is that you jump too late and you bounce your head into this ridge over here and that's something you don't want to do because if you do that you will still be crouching underneath here and you basically waste all your speed so you want to crouch on time so you're stuck so you're kind of stuck underneath here and whenever you get that feeling in the jump right um like this one right here see i'm underneath here and i didn't bounce my head see again like i kind of get the uh, jump down and then it's just onto the luck part of the scrolling and the timing of your b hopping just for the sake of the tutorial i put sv auto bunny hopping uh one on just to show you guys and i would actually recommend you guys to do this as well when you're practicing it because uh b hopping with scroll is harder to do and less common to hit hops than whenever you're doing it with this and actually the thing you want to practice the most here is the jump the strafe and the crouch and the scrolling comes last that's just actually down to the luck and with the uh, auto bunny hopping command you'll have a 100% success rate so boys that was it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you have any suggestions on what you want to learn next or what i could show you i know i'm not the best at the movement thing in csgo but i do i'm able to teach you a thing or two so let me know what you want to learn or what i should show you in the next video and i'll probably do that so leave it down in the comments leave a like on the video and that's about it for today guys i'll see you later peace <coughs> and of course guys a happy new year i hope you're all having a fantastic 2017 best greetings from matt cs and i'm out i'm actually out now i'm out leave the video a like like